So how do we start? I ask you a question, you respond. You ask, I respond. And since this is not a let me impress you first date, we can be honest with each other. Okay. And since we don't have forever, I think we should limit ourselves to 20 questions. 20 questions? And no private questions. But if we want to know each other, we need to ask private questions. No private questions, personal ones are fine. What's the difference? You'll know when I don't answer. Fair enough. You want to go first? No, you go. Okay. Why psychiatry? I like to uncover the truth within human minds. Why accounting? I like to uncover the lies hidden in corporate books. <laughs> I'm just being funny. Uh, I audit. What kind of food do you like? I love chaat. Well, I love Chinese. Uh, at Wang's. I also enjoy cooking. It's like therapy. As long as I don't have to do it seven times a week. What about you? Do I cook? I make excellent instant coffee. That's about it. That's not cooking. Well, it, if it comes down to me cooking, I usually eat out or take out. Do you eat meat? Occasionally. Uh, do you have a problem with that? Not particularly. I'm a vegan. Do you have a problem with that? Vegan? Uh, I'm fine. Do you watch movies? Of course. Who doesn't? I hope you watch movies. I love movies. Uh, English or Hindi? Full on Bollywood masala films. For Shah Rukh Khan, it's first day for sure. I watch a lot of foreign films, like uh, Scorsese, Fellini. These are names of actors. Directors? Books? I can't fall asleep without reading a book. You mean to say, books make you sleep? Very smart. I mean I read every night. <laughs> I love to read too. Uh, what about music? Jai Ho Rehman. It's techno for me. What's that? Electronic music without vocals. Music without words. Yeah, I mean, techno does have poetry in it. Uh, it helps me focus on my work. Are you religious? That's a private question. My relationship with God is my business. So you do have a relationship with God? Do you? My parents say I'm semi-religious. Semi? Yeah, I mean, I don't go to the temples, but uh, I have been known to pray. And uh, I believe that religious privacy is a recipe for world peace. Okay, I wonder if this is a personal or a private question. Give it a try. Uh, do you consider yourself sexual? Oh. Uh, firstly, that's a very private question and secondly, it's my turn to ask. But we need to know that if we have to live together forever. You'll have to wait and find out. What about you? Uh, I think I'm very sexual. How do you know that you're very sexual? <laughs> that's a private question. <laughs> It's a close call for you, mister. Let's try an easy one. Do you drink? Occasionally. On occasions as in Christmas and New Year's? Actually, it's more like once or twice a month. What about you? Um, I smoke, not once or twice a month, more like at parties and stuff like that. It's a good thing my mom isn't here. Uh... Why? Would she object? <laughs> no. She smokes too. <laughs> <laughs>
What are your goals in life? The same as every middle class person's goals. Earn enough to be at peace. That's your goal. I do have others. Such as? Such as travel the world, learn how to swim, take part in a marathon. They evolve. What about you? I want to be able to help people. Help? How? Not sure yet. Okay. Here comes a big one. If you see a bunch of guys teasing a girl in the middle of a street, would you stop them? Uh, well, not if I'm alone. See, I'm not built that way to behave like a hero, but uh, I may throw something at them and run away. What if we were married and somebody attacked me? I'm not too sure what I would do, but I would throw something more and maybe call for help. When you see a kid begging on the street, what do you do? Are these questions from your couch sessions? Okay, uh, well, I would definitely not be able to rescue him, but I would spare some change. Your turn to ask. Or you can carry on if you want to. Do you plan to live with your parents after marriage? Absolutely. I am the only son. In fact, your parents can live with us too. Because I am the only child. Same rule applies. Are you nuts? We'll all kill each other. But why not? Because it never works. How can you say that without even trying? I think our 20 questions are up. I counted 15. Sorry? You can ask me more questions. What's the point? What do you mean? Can I put this bluntly? Can't you see we have nothing in common except that our parents would like to check marriage off their list? On the contrary, I was looking for someone with very little in common. Really? No wonder you need your parents to find you a wife. Don't you want to look forward to something new in life? I mean, imagine a world where all the films ever made had the same plot. But we need to have at least something in common, right? Or else we'll be fighting about everything. And I don't want to find out the hard way. I'll take fights over loneliness. Can I ask you a couple of more questions? What makes you sad? When someone disrespects me. And what makes you happy? Many things. A walk on Marine Drive on a cloudy day. Music that plays to my senses. A new spice. Can I tell you my goals? We've already covered that. I told you they evolve. Sure. Well, I want to learn how to make chart. I want to listen to Rahman. And I want to start going to the gym. The gym? Yeah to beat up the bad guys if they harass you. That's not funny. Okay, I'm sorry, I know it's not. But you know, when I walked in here, I was as nervous as you are. I'm a simple half full guy. I adapt when adapting is required. I cross the bridge when I get there. Do you know how it feels when you're lost and you find your way? I think I do. Well, I feel that way right now. And I think you're the best half I can ever find. 
But people change after marriage. Haven't you heard the saying that every woman wishes her man doesn't change after marriage and every man wishes his wife does? That saying goes the other way around. But sure, let's meet again and talk some more. Sure. Uh, so can I tell my mom I found my wife? <laughs> this is a disaster. What about the backup plan? Hey. Hi. What do you have there for me? Hope you like it. My gift is for your eyes only. And I heard that. <laughs> I'm curious. Happy anniversary. Thank you. Got a rush. Had to kick some monkey's ass today. Are you ready for your gift? 